Hi everyone, it's Miss Debbie from the Richfield Park Public Library. Today I'm going to read you a nonfiction book. A nonfiction book is a book about facts. In this case, we are going to learn about a sea turtle. But before I begin reading the story, I would like to thank Harper Publishing, who has given us permission to read this book to you online. There's a picture of a sea turtle. Where do you think it lives? Look at the, the picture very carefully. What if you wish you were a sea turtle? Then you became a green sea turtle. Could you swim like a sea turtle? Eat like a sea turtle? Spend most of your life underwater? And would you want to? Find out. Where would you live? Green sea turtles live in warm oceans around the world. They live underwater, except when it's time to lay eggs. Mother turtles leave the water to lay their eggs on sandy beaches. Have you ever visited an ocean? How would your life begin? A mother sea turtle clears away sand with her front flippers and digs a hole with her back flippers. The hole is a nest where she lays about 100 eggs. The mother sea turtle covers the eggs with sand and goes back to the ocean. Sand hides the eggs from hungry animals. Two months later, the eggs hatch. The baby turtles wiggle their way out of the sand. Baby turtles are, are called hatchings. When hatchings leave the nest, they race towards the ocean as fast as their flippers will go. Tiny turtles are not safe on land. Gulls and other seabirds might catch them. Where would you go? Baby sea turtles swim way out into the ocean. They live far from land. When the sea turtles get bigger, they move to shallow water near ocean shores. How would you breathe? Sea turtles live underwater, but they need to breathe air. They stick their faces out of the water to breathe. When sea turtles are sleeping, they can stay underwater for five hours without taking a breath. Can you hold your breath underwater? Where would you sleep? Sea turtles sleep underwater. Sometimes they nap while floating. Sea turtles tuck themselves under rock ledges to sleep safely at night. What would you eat? Green sea turtles eat sea grasses, seaweed, and other plants that grow in the ocean. Their sharp beaks help them eat these plants. Have you ever eaten seaweed? How would you wash up? Sea turtles do not get dirty, but plants grow on their shells and tiny bugs crawl on their skin. Those things can be itchy. Fish nibble off the bugs and plants. Their nibbling helps keep sea turtles clean and comfortable. How would growing up change you? Green sea turtles are fully grown when they are 20 years old. Then they are ready for migration. 
migration means that turtles paddle hundreds of miles back to the same beaches where they hatched. Sea turtles migrate to find mates. The female turtles lay eggs. Then all the adult turtles swim back to the places where they can find their favorite foods. Have you ever been far from home? Being a sea turtle could be cool, but do you want to live underwater? It nibbled clean by fish? Swim for hundreds of miles? Luckily, you don't have to. You're not a sea turtle. You're you. Did you know? This book is about the green sea turtle. There are six other kinds of sea turtles, too. The biggest kind is the leatherback sea turtle, which can weigh over 1,000 pounds. The loggerhead sea turtle has a strong beak to crush the hard shells of clams and crabs. The hawksbill sea turtle has a beautiful pattern on its shell. Sea turtles can live for over 50 years. Wild words. These are the important words that we learned from this nonfiction book. Flippers. Paddle shape arms and legs. Hatchings. Do you remember what hatchings are? It's a turtle that has recently hatched from an egg. Migration. Traveling a long distance to nest and feed. Nest, a hole in the sand where a mother sea turtle lays eggs. Sea turtle, a turtle that lives in the ocean. Seagrass, a grass-like plant that grows in the ocean. The end. Now, are you ready to kahoot? Okay. Let's go play a game.